The first signs of spring are upon us as the crypto markets have finally turned green. A number of trading indicators are confirming the reversal and Michael Saylor says he is not worried about the bear market. All of that and more in this week's video. I'm your host, Leia Heilpern, and this is the Exodus Crypto News. It's a great day for hodlers as the markets have finally turned green. Bitcoin has gained 9% in the last 48 hours and Ethereum is up 10%. Cardano is even up 25% in the last day, which is a welcome relief for ADA investors. If you feel like the crypto market has been unusually depressing lately, that's not just your imagination. This was the first time in history that Bitcoin traded down for eight weeks in a row. That bearish action gave lots of people the slip and many traders have lost a lot of money betting on BTC's reversal. Now that the markets have finally turned bullish though, we're likely to see more green in the near term. With this recent move above $31,000, Bitcoin has broken out of a downtrend on the Relative Strength Index or RSI as it's more commonly known. Once an asset breaks a trend on the RSI, it typically indicates a reversal. Other indicators are also suggesting that a move higher is in the cards. The Bitcoin Fear and Greed Index has been hovering in the low teens for the last several weeks. Whenever sentiment gets that low, it's a fairly reliable indicator that a bullish reversal is imminent. But how long could the markets go up for? Well, here's what Hayden Hughes, the CEO of the trading platform Alpha Impact, has to say. And I quote, markets are long overdue for a relief rally. Bitcoin just went through eight consecutive weeks in red territory and got technically oversold to levels we traditionally only see at the bottom of the bear market. Michael Saylor, the CEO of MicroStrategy, remains unfazed by declining prices. A few days ago, Michael gave an interview on Fox News with Tucker Carlson and reiterated why he believes that Bitcoin is the one asset that everyone should own. Here's Michael in his own words, and I quote, If you zoom out two years since the beginning of the COVID crisis, the US money supply has expanded 36%, gold is up 7%, the S&P index is up 29%, the Nasdaq only up 19%, Bitcoin is up 229%. So if you can stomach the volatility, you can take the long view. You've got a safe haven there. Whenever I have some spare cash, we buy more Bitcoin. We are taking a very, very long view toward this. Michael makes a great point. Even though Bitcoin hasn't been doing very well lately, it is still up 300% since the start of the pandemic two years ago. The recent bearish action might not be the market that we all want right now. However, the silver lining is that these prices are a great opportunity to buy the dip. Once these ugly macro conditions sort themselves out, crypto will be well poised to resume a bull market trend. Thanks for watching, everyone. We've got a lot more videos for you, so just click any of these to keep watching. Until next time, hodl on.